Can you just give us your impression so, so far of, of the route now that you've seen it? Yeah, it's um, it's a tough Tour de France for the sprinters. Um, I think the the climbers and the guys for the general classmen they will be very happy about it. For us, we have to look for every sprint chance, and uh, then you have to use it. How many stages at this at this at this point do you think are, are tailor made for for your characteristics? Yeah, I I didn't see any profiles for, so far, but um, I think between four and five stages can be um, can be very good for for the pure sprinters. And is the green jersey a realistic aim now, given that there are going to be some modifications to the points classification? That's also that also depends on the on on the profiles of certain stages. And uh, yeah, I think it's it's a good change. It's uh, something um, that supports or, or gives um, gives the pure sprinters a, a way back into that competition. And um, I hope that uh, it can be yeah, a topic for me next year already. And given the success you've had in the Tour de France in the last couple of years, what are your realistic aims? I mean, I know you said that four or five potentially for the sprinters, but would you be happy with in terms of quote in terms of wins? I, I, I said it. I actually said it every year. Now. I said it also in 2014 when people asked me about how many stage wins are you going to do now or to have, and I don't know. Maybe I go home with 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 zero or with I crash out of the race. And um, for me, that's not a way how I approach a race.